Ooh, I still got some nuggets left over from the other day. Ooh, they're nice nuggets. Mmm, I wish I had some dipping. Oh, what's this? Ooh, this is me. What is this? Oh, this is um old world quality foods. And it's a um, mustard. And it's horseradish mustard. Let's see. Uh, imported and distributed by Old World Quality Foods, Elk Grove Village in Illinois. Ooh, that might be a. a, 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 a oh, I'll we'll have to try it out. Let's see what it tastes like. Oh, and then I got another one here. And this one's pear mustard. And when did they start? Did it say when they started? Doesn't really say when they started. No. Product from, oh, Poland. Product from Poland. So maybe it's Poland that made it, and then they ship it to this company, or maybe they were Polish, the people that work here. But this one's a pair of mustard. So we're going to try a little bit of everything, both. All right, let's open up the... Horseradish one first. Well, let's go with the mild one first. We're going to go with the pear so we can get the actual pear flavor. I don't know if I can smell the pear. Maybe. I'll get that little bit off the top there. Uh oh. Well, let me dip it up. Put that in there. Let me get the top part off here. We're just going to try it without any, any sauce. Get a little bit on our finger. Ooh, tastes just like a pear. All right, let me let me uh, dip this in the uh, mustard here and get a little bit of it. It's got a kind of yellow, yellowish mustard. Yeah, it smells like a pear. Mm. So I'll try it on on the on the nugget. Wow, that is amazing. I can taste the mustard. The mustard is there, definitely a mustard. But it's not a hot mustard. It's a sweet mustard. And with the pear flavor in there, it really tastes like a pear. Just like you were to have bitten into a, 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 a juicy, plump, you know, juicy pear that would just mm, bursting with flavor of, you know, you got peach, peach, peach juice all over your face when you get through eating the peach. Mm. That's what I'm talking about. This is some good stuff. The pear mustard from Old World. Old World. And it's made in Poland or made from Polish people from Poland that lived in that city. Now let's smell the next one. Ooh, I can smell the the Horseradish. We'll see how hot it is though when we when we go in here. Let me get another little nugget here, <laughs> and we're gonna dip in here and get a big portion of it. Put it right there on top so we can get the. Let's try the uh, the the stuff first, you know, before we try the nugget. Yeah, it tastes just like horseradish in the mustard. And of course, again, it to me, it's not that hot. But we're going to try it on the nugget with a lot of horseradish.
simple. It's um, water, mustard seeds, spirit vinegar, sugar, horseradish, about 4%, salt, natural flavors, and spices. And that was the uh, the uh, honey, or the horseradish honey, mustard. I mean, the horseradish mustard. The other one is uh, water, uh, pear puree, 10%, apple puree, sugar, mustard seed, spirit vinegar, concentrated pear juice, 5%, citrus fiber, salt, um, natural flavors, spices, and to give it that color, it's got uh, rib riboflavins, rib riboflavins. Mm. It's kind of like a mild flavor. It's a mild horseradish with only 4%. It's not that hot. You know, it's kind of sweet. It's kind of like you can taste it in there, but it's not like the 10% of the pear. It's more like it's just just a tint of it in there. It's like they put the mustard in there and then it was like, wait, 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 don't close the lid. Let, let me put a teaspoon in there. You know, just enough to flavor it with a little bit of horseradish. You know, I think it would have been better if they would have put maybe half and half or maybe a 25% of the mustard would be would be just a lot better. 25% would be, I think it would be a lot better flavor than the the 4%. But of course, you know, maybe that's what they were looking for. Just a hint of horseradish compared to, uh, uh, you could definitely taste a, a, a difference in the horseradish one and the, pea, and the pear one. Yeah, let's see. Uh, and I only paid like a dollar and 25 cents or dollar, dollar 25 cents for these two at the Dollar Tree. Now, if they had some more flavors, I would have gotten a whole bunch of them. But I was like, nah, I guess I'll just, you know, get these two. Uh, which one did I like better? Of course, the pear. The pear mustard was really good. I could tell it was a pear right off the back. It was like, it was nice and just the right of sweetness to it. The right amount of, of pear juice in it. Pear concentrate or whatever, you know, the puree or whatever, just to give it the right flavor and everything. The uh, horseradish would have probably been better if they would have done like maybe 10% like they did with the pear, you know, and added some, you know, horseradish juice or something to it, then it would have probably been better. But uh, yeah, the clear winner was the uh, pear mustard. But like I said, if you want to go and get some, you can get it at the Dollar Tree. And it's called Old World Quality Foods. And it says it's, it's a product from Poland. But anyway, that's our video. Y'all have a awesome day and a perfect tomorrow, and we'll catch you at Scratchy Post where we can meow about. I got some more catnip somewhere. Do you have any catnip? Do you have any catnip? What about you, girl? You got some catnip over there? If they had some catnip, I could like sprinkle in here and tell everybody it's parsley or thyme or or oregano. But anyway, that's our video. Y'all have a awesome day. And... Oh, Harry said. Anyway, bye. Must be too much catnip lately.